All right, guys, both lines are in the water. Both lines are out. Guys, last week I tried to come here and I swear to God, I was literally standing right here and I was getting wet from the waves. That's how rough it was. So I, I literally didn't even fish. I literally just came out here and just was chilling out. But I'm not even lying. You, It was like a washing machine in here, guys. I'm talking about at least six foot waves everywhere. Just pounding the wall. So guys, both of our lines are out. We're about to hook up the dock demon and then we're going to get out, all right? This one's getting bites, guys. I think we're about to be on, guys. We're about to be on. Something's taking it, guys. Something is really trying to take it. There we go, guys. Something is really trying to take it. Come on, baby, take it. Come on, baby. My line just got so tight, guys. Something was definitely touching it. I think he is. There he goes, there he goes, guys. I think I have a fish on. I'm not even kidding you. Guys, I have a fish on. I'm almost certain I have a fish on right now. I'm just gonna let him kind of swim around with it. But I'm almost certain that I have a big black drum on right now. There he goes, guys. There he goes. There he goes, guys. There he goes. 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 There he goes, guys. All right, guys. I'm on. I'm on, guys. shoot i'm on guys i'm on new rod and reel new rod and reel guys new rod and reel the black drum i haven't been here 20 minutes guys and literally just got absolutely hammered <sighs> come on baby i don't know how i'm gonna land this fish but i'm gonna have to make it work <sighs> All right, guys, I just called this fellow angler over. Um, I think I honestly might have the other line, but I'm gonna see if he'll help me net this fish that I have. I don't even know if it's a black drum, guys. It feels kind of small. Um, if you don't mind, bro, would you mind netting this fish if it's a big drum? Because I, I think that's what it is, man. It might be a big old catfish, dude. <laughs> All uh, right, now he's feeling kind of heavy, guys. It looked like a big sail cat, which is really what I hope it's. I hope it's not a big sail. I mean, he's fighting really weird. He's going straight for the bottom. No, that's a that's a redfish. It's either a redfish or a drum, guys. 100%. I, I have the net in my uh, in my cart, man. If you want to grab that. It's not very big, guys, but it's either a, a small black drum or a redfish. I think it honestly might be a redfish, guys. He's really hugging those walls, too. Really hugging those walls. Oh, I love the sound of Shimano, Shimano's drags, guys. It's a redfish, man. It's a nice slot red. All right, bro. Hey, that's good. You can go ahead and drop it down, bro. All right, guys, this guy's gonna help me net this guy. Should be good, homie. All right, let me pull him to you. All right, pull up, bro. Get him. Heck yes. Thanks, brother, dude. I appreciate that, man. There you go, guys. What a beautiful fish. What's your name, dude? Kyra. Kyra? Kyron. Kyron. Thank you, Kyron, man. I appreciate it. That would have been a pain in the butt to uh to get yourself, you know? Alright guys, I wasn't here for 20 minutes and I pulled pulled off a nice slot red. Um he might not be slot. I'm gonna go measure him, but right now I'm gonna say slot. But uh nice fish, pretty good fight. My first fish on my new reel, the Shimano Nasky, I think is what it is, and I actually am using an ugly stick rod, so Really good setup. He fought like heck. But yeah, guys, we're gonna get him. In a, we're actually gonna get a measurement on him real fast. You wanna follow me, man? And uh, we're gonna see how much, how uh, long he is. I think he might make slot, but guys, he is slot. Here, put that camera. 
right oh shoot hold on guys he is at zero right now and he is right there at 27 yeah 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 there you go he's right there at 27 guys beautiful fish so we're gonna we're gonna keep him guys we're actually probably about to just go home <laughs> now that we got our fish but we might do a catch and cook guys so stay tuned what is going on guys this is kyle here and guys i am so stoked that we just caught that redfish honestly i was here probably for 10 minutes guys if that 10 minutes and he just sucked up the bait guys and just absolutely hammered it and that was my first fish on the new reel which was which, which was a shimano Noski, I think is what it was. But anyways, we're about to go to Everman's Cafe, guys, and we're gonna do we're gonna do a catch and cook on this redfish, guys. We're gonna go there, get some cooking supplies, go back to the house, and I haven't decided yet if we're gonna fry it or blacken it, but I want to blacken it, guys. So we're gonna go to the house. Well, first we're gonna go by Everman's, pick up the cooking supplies, pick up some herbs, and then we're gonna go to the house and we're gonna eat it, guys. So stay tuned. Alright, guys. Heading up to Everman's Cafe. We're about to get the grocery supplies. All right, guys. This is Kabartek Media right here. What's up, dude? What's up, dude? <laughs> What's up? Hey, guess what, bro? What's up? I caught a 27-inch redfish, bro. Caught a 27-inch redfish. Yeah, and I'm doing a catch and cook, man. I'm coming here getting catch groceries. Coming here, right. getting grocery supplies, and then blacking them up. All right. Some spices, some butter. About five minutes on, not five, probably about two or three minutes <laughs> on each side. Nine heat. That's going to be good. Mouth, That's going to be good, isn't it? Can't wait to see it, bro. All right, man. I'll see you later, bro. All right, guys. We're going to get some butter and some seasoning. guys i just got some organic dried mangoes these are keys okay honestly if you guys have never tried these come to ever to get some they're awesome they're awesome guys check out all these spices all right guys what is going on i just filleted that redfish and now what i'm doing guys is i'm soaking the meat in some milk so we're gonna let that sit for about 15 minutes, guys, and then we're gonna go, we're gonna put it on the skillet with some butter and some blackening seasoning, guys. I have a feeling it's gonna taste really, 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 really good. Guys, if you're watching still, make sure to smack that like button, guys, and make sure you subscribe, especially if you're from the Pensacola area, guys, because I'm gonna be making a ton of fishing videos here in the next couple of weeks, guys. Honestly, I love doing it. I'm not gonna stop. Fish is my passion, and it's honestly so fun for me, and I hope it's enjoyable for you guys to watch after a long day of work and stuff like that. So make sure you subscribe, guys, and I will see you guys back in the kitchen. Guys, I put the fillets on the skillet with the butter and olive oil, and it's smelling delicious right now, guys. It shouldn't take long. This one right here actually might take a little bit longer just because it's a pretty thick fillet, but this guy right here on the left shouldn't take that long at all. But yeah, my mouth's watering. Can't wait. Stay tuned. Guys, right, the first two pieces just came out. Look how good that big play looks, guys. Oh my goodness gracious. This is going to taste so freaking good. I don't know. I'm about to put some lemon juice on it too, guys. Last two pieces are cooking up. Alright guys, I'm going to get my first bite. I've had redfish before, so I'm not going to be too surprised if it tastes really good because I know these fish taste really, really phenomenal. But yeah guys, first bite. Got to get a big bite. Mm -mm -mm. Guys, that fish is absolutely phenomenal. It tastes just how I expected, guys. Really, really Kind of firm, but really, really rich at the same time, guys. And that butter and that old bay season just puts the icing around the cake. Mmm. <clears throat> I had this Terry Ho's Yum Yum Sauce, the original. I'm going to try to put some of this Yum Yum Sauce to the side. I'm going to see how it tastes with it. So, yeah, we're going to give that a try, too. Blackened redfish, Yum Yum. 
All right, guys, I just got the yum yum sauce on the side. I just put some yum yum sauce on the side. We're gonna dip the redfish in there. <clears throat> Gosh, that redfish is getting my throat. All right, guys, we just put some yum yum sauce to the side. We're gonna dip some of this black and redfish in there. We're gonna give it a try. Looks good. Wow, I'm not gonna lie, guys. That yum yum sauce actually, it actually was really good with that redfish. I'm not even kidding you. I'm gonna, I'm gonna get another bite, just because I didn't put a whole lot on, but it tasted pretty good, guys. Let's go, let's go in for, let's go in for a little bit, a little bit deeper taste. Mmm, phenomenal, guys. I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys the sauce. Just because I really highly recommend it. It is Terry Ho's Yum Yum Sauce, the original. And it is pretty dang good, I'm not gonna lie. A lot better than I thought. A lot better than I thought. Alright guys, that is it for the video. I hope you all enjoyed. The redfish was absolutely phenomenal, guys. I had a really, really fun time catching it. Honestly, I wasn't even there for 5 minutes or 10 minutes before I even hooked up, so... It was a win-win for me. I went out, had fun, didn't have to wait all night to get a bite, took it home, cooked it up, and it was a dang good meal. Guys, thank you all for the support on the channel. I really can't thank you all enough. I mean, I started about two months ago or three months ago. I've really been serious about it for the past month, but just want to say thank you all for everybody that supports it and leaves a comment. Those comments mean a lot, man, or guys and women. And uh, all the likes you guys put on the videos, those mean a lot. And all the, and the subscriptions and stuff, it's just absolutely crazy, guys. I'm grateful for you all. Hope you all have a good Thanksgiving tomorrow. I'm going to wake up. Leave a comment of what your favorite Thanksgiving dish is. Mine is sweet potato casserole. I can't wait for that. But, yeah, guys, have a good Thanksgiving. I'll see you all soon. Peace out.